Bobcat's been running a little rough, and occasionally I see some white smoke popping out of that tailpipe, so I'm a little concerned that it has a blown head gasket. So today we're gonna check, and we're gonna find out, is the head blown? This is an Evercraft block tester. Um, it's actually a kind of simple device. You just have, you have three parts, two of them right here. Uh, this part holds the fluid, and this part pulls air through this section. Um, you're going to put this on your um, radiator and then you're going to so pull air through the fluid that's going to be inside of here. If there's exhaust fumes inside of your radiator and it goes through this, the fluid's going to change color and then you have a blown head gasket. So that's what we're going to do today is we're going to check if a Bobcat has a blown head gasket or not. Hopefully not. So step one is to have your truck idling and warm. I have it off right now just for audio reasons, um, but it's been idled and, or it's been warmed up and it was idling earlier. Then you've got to drain a little bit of fluid out of the radiator um, because you don't want to pull any fluid up into the other fluid. If you pull, if you cross um, contaminate those fluids, you're going to show a bad um, reading. And so you drain it down a little ways. I drained it down to about that first fin um, down in the bucket below so that it has a little room when I put that device on the top. It's not going to suck any of the radiator coolant up into there. So you can see right here there is a fill level line. So what we're going to do is they uh, provide you with this uh, fluid. We're going to fill this up to that level line right there. There we go. Once you fill up the coolant or that level with the fluid, you just add the top back on the top. And then we're going to add this breather valve up in here. I think we go this way. And then you can see how that draws air through the device and through that, that copper or brass ring in there. I think it's copper. So we're gonna do that when the engine's running, I just wanted to talk about it while it's off. Um, you've got to do this motion for two minutes. All right, let's try it out. All right, now we have the engine running. What we're gonna do is we're gonna do this for two minutes. Start your clock. I'm super excited. This did not change color. It should go from blue to yellow and mine stayed blue the entire time. Um, if you do have a head gasket leak, then those fumes um, would get down into the water system, come up through the radiator, through this fluid and change the color from blue to yellow. Mine stayed the same blue the entire time, so I don't have a leak at all. So that's great news. You can grab these from your local auto parts store. They let me rent this one out, but I'll put a link down below in the description if you want to grab one off of Amazon. I appreciate everybody watching. Hammer down on that subscribe button, and don't forget, keep crawling.